Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Avisola. So today we are making this oven grilled croaker fish. Um, so this fish I made it in a way that it would taste like the type we have in lounge bars, club, and all. And it's so sweet and yummy. <laughs> I've come, I've come again with my eyes and everything. So you know the usual thing. If you're a first time viewer, thank you very much for clicking on this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to share. Don't forget to drop a comment. See, you guys are just awesome. Like I've seen a lot of comments that impress me, and I always say like, you guys keep me going. When I see your comment, I feel oh, so that you don't, you can't give up. <laughs> it's too late to give up because sometimes it's quite a take to keep up with all these things. But I am glad that you guys are back again and we are making croaker fish so let's get started guys so i'm going to be using croaker fish and i have two of them here i'll make sure i remove the gear from the market the intestine and everything from the market before um i got home because i couldn't go through the stress of removing it it's quite stressful and i wanted it very clean and they do it perfectly there in the market so now i'm going to do the mixture that i'll be cutting the fish with so i i have my crushed st uh, stock cubes i have salt i have cayenne pepper and i have um curry soya spice so then i'm going to add honey and also i'm going to add um vegetable oil you can use canola oil or canola oil rather or um, olive oil or any oil of your choice um, also i have lime juice you can use lemon juice if you don't have lime juice you can use lemon juice too so i'm going to mix everything together i'm going to be using this to coat my fish before i first put it in the oven then We'll proceed from there <laughs> if you're a first time viewer don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like don't forget to share my video thank you very much for coming back uh, if you're a returning subscriber so now i'm coating my fish with the mixture i have made earlier so tell me how did you can use this for any other fish you could use this for tilapia um any fish of your choice you can grill them like this but um, even catfish although i don't really like catfish so i prefer to use croaker most time when i want to grill my fish so yeah i'm coating it with my brush so i'll make sure i put it into every part of this fish like feel that fill it in like i have to coat all the mixture in i want it to enter it so deeply that when i'm eating it like it's basically i'm eating it with the sauce don't forget to subscribe to my channel don't forget to like my videos don't forget to share thank you very much for always clicking on my video and watching i really appreciate so you can see me feel it feeling the mixture inside the fish this will be perfect for all these um thank god it's friday thing at home um you know just sit down netflix and chill and you're yeah, chilling with your fish so i actually cut that part of the fish i don't know if you can see the three lines on it you just need your knife to create those three lines so that the sauce can enter inside the vt you know what i mean by enter inside it so now um i'm done with that so i have to prepare my fish for grilling so i will grill it for 20 to 30 minutes in the oven you can use normal griller too for this so now i want to make another sauce so i've put my oil on fire on the stove um now my onions i'll make sure the onion is transparent before i add my pepper mix if you have watched this video to this point that means you enjoyed it please don't forget to subscribe so now i'm adding my pepper mix Add um, garlic paste. So I have paprika, salt, thyme, curry, ketchup. So 
So I'll make sure my sauce is then crushed cubes. Then onion. Don't worry, the measurement is going to be in the description box below. Make sure you check it for measurements. So now my sauce is already drying up. And what if it is fried? <laughs> So now I'm going to I brought out my fish after I've grilled it for 20 to 30 minutes. So I'm going to add the sauce, fill it in again before I return it back to the oven. So if you watched this video to this point, thank you very much. And don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to like, don't forget to share my video. Don't forget to also comment, drop a comment. Let's get to know ourselves. I really want to know you. <laughs> I want you to know me. So don't forget, follow me on my social media account. The Abisola on Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. Sorry, and Twitter. Thank you very much for watching, guys. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye.